the Medical College of Georgia. With 240 students per class, MCG is amongst the nation's largest medical schools by class size. Our main campus has its home in Augusta, Georgia. Our reach extends across the state with regional clinical campuses for third and fourth year students in Rome, Albany, Brunswick, and Savannah. In partnership with the University of Georgia, we have a second four-year campus in Athens. Thanks to expanding partnerships with physicians and hospitals across Georgia, we provide over 350 sites for full immersion medical education. Physician faculty operate in 100 clinics and hospitals statewide. Our goal, to train and retain primary care physicians statewide, especially underrepresented minorities from underserved communities. How are we accomplishing this? Through a pipeline of education. This pipeline starts with phase one, K through 12. Then students move on to phase two, pursuing an undergraduate degree. From there, phase three is acceptance into medical school, which leads us to phase three plus, which consists of primary care residency training. This is the pipeline of graduate medical education that creates medical professionals in Georgia. The most important step in keeping those medical professionals in Georgia occurs in Phase 3 plus. Currently, just 40% of students who graduate from MCG remain in Georgia. That number increases to 60% for MCG graduates who also complete their primary care residency training in Georgia. When those graduates are given the opportunity to earn loan forgiveness, that number increases to 80% that remain in Georgia. More medical professionals means better access to care and a healthier Georgia. But the benefits don't stop there. No, in fact, this causes a ripple effect that has a massive positive impact on the Georgia economy. It is estimated that by the year 2028, the economic impact of the physician workforce that remains in Georgia will grow to $442 million annually. This will also generate an additional 2,948 jobs. The economic benefit to underserved communities is quite impressive as well. By 2028, it is estimated that 48 MCG-trained primary care physicians will become doctors for 48 communities in need each year. This means that their workforce economic impact will grow to $106.1 million annually. Additionally, there will be $241.2 million in cost savings from doctors. Combined, this means a total of $347.3 million in economic benefit to the state annually. Each physician who establishes a practice in the state generates an average of $2.2 million in economic impact for the state. If they establish a primary care practice in an underserved area, they can generate $3.6 million in healthcare utilization savings annually. This also creates an average of 14 additional jobs and generates an average of $300,000 in regional tax revenue per year. For every MCG graduate who practices in an underserved area in Georgia, their total value to the state equals $7.2 million annually. In short, a one-time investment can yield decades of statewide benefits. All of this together leads us to a happier, healthier, and more prosperous Georgia.